In May of 2019, Deputy Travis Michael English brought international ridicule upon himself and the Columbia County, Florida Sheriff's Office for his ill-advised arrest of a Lake City man named Dylan Webb. The arrest was over a window decal that read, I eat ass. What's going on, gentlemen? My name is Deputy English. Hey, man, the reason I'm pulling you over is your uh, derogatory st sticker on the back of your truck. What is that? Uh, How's it not derogatory? It's words. It's words, okay. What do those words mean? It's ass and eat. I eat ass, okay. So some 10-year-old little kid sitting in the passenger seat of his mama's vehicle looks over and reads that I eat ass and asks his mom what it means. How's she going to explain that? That's the parents' job. Right? Okay, let me see your driver's license. Listen to me. What you have on the back of your window, okay, is a misdemeanor in the state of Florida, okay? I have four kids, a 14-year-old, a 10-year-old, a 6-year-old, and a 4-month-old. If my 6-year-old was to look at me and be like, Dad, what does I.E. ask me, okay, it would be furious, all right? I'm going to have you uh, take off one of those letters so that no, the word... That. You're not refreshing my First Amendment right. You're not doing that. I'm going to need a copy of your t uh, ID, too. It's all on that ticket right there. So, all right, hang tight right there for me, then. Place your hands behind your back. For what? Place your hands behind your back. For what? Because you're going to jail, son. For what? For what? Because I gave you the option to take that off your window, okay? That is a violation of a Florida State statute, and it is a misdemeanor, okay? And then I asked you to take it off, and you refused. Let's step back here. No, you're going to step back here. Thankfully, Assistant State Attorney John Foster Durrett dropped all charges against Mr. Webb and issued the following written statement. Having evaluated the evidence through the prism of Supreme Court precedent, it is determined the defendant has a valid defense to be raised under the First Amendment of our United States Constitution. Using Florida's broad public records law, Photography is Not a Crime submitted a public records request for copies of the complete personnel file of Deputy Travis Michael English. Upon receiving and reviewing the records, Photography is Not a Crime discovered that Deputy English has a troubling and criminal history. The English Driver History Since 2004, Deputy English has racked up an astonishing 17 traffic citations, including but not limited to one citation for no proof of insurance, one citation for careless driving, and nine citations for speeding. All of these tickets would eventually lead to Mr. English's driver's license being suspended. But Mr. English knowingly violated the law by continuing to drive anyway until he was busted and charged for driving with a suspended license. The English Undetected Crimes Have you ever committed an act that you were not caught doing, but if caught, you would have been arrested? Deputy English checked yes, and then his own writing. I experimented with marijuana when I was a teenager. Have you ever served probation, parole, or community service? Deputy English checked yes. In his own writing, community service when I was 12 or 13 for possession of tobacco at school. Since you have been an adult, 18 years old, have you ever had any sexual involvement with someone under 18 years old? Deputy English checked yes. If yes, how old were they? In his own writing, my ex-wife was two years younger than me. We dated from when she was 16 and I was 18. The English Arrest Record Have you ever been arrested, charged, or detained by a law enforcement agency, including military apprehension? Deputy English was arrested twice in 2006, once for battery and once after getting into a physical altercation with his girlfriend. Regarding the physical altercation with his girlfriend, Deputy English wrote, While at a football game in 2006, I got into an argument with my girlfriend. She went to walk away and I grabbed her by her arms. She turned around and slapped me. A nearby deputy came and asked what was going on. I told him it was none of his business. He arrested me and the charges were later dropped. In 2008, Deputy English was arrested, found guilty, and disciplined for committing larceny as a United States Marine. Regarding the larceny arrest, Deputy English wrote, In 2008, myself and a fellow Marine went to the PX. While there, we swapped the price tags on a backpack. We continued to the checkout line. The lady scanned everything, and I proceeded to the exit with the bags while the other guy paid. When I reached the exit, an MP was there waiting on us. 
We were charged with stealing everything, and I received 45 days restriction, half-month pay for two months, reduction in rank, and not recommended for promotion for six months. Digging deeper into Deputy English's personnel file, photography is not a crime discovered an interagency-initiated investigation. The investigation found that in March of 2019, Deputy English executed a reckless pit maneuver, endangering the lives of the suspects and Deputy English himself. Photography is not a crime has submitted a public records request for a copy of the dash cam video from Deputy English's car, showing the reckless pit maneuver. Stay tuned for the video and more information as we dig deeper into Deputy English's personnel file.